Could you help save a life? We've learned that 60% of people who witness cardiac mm. arrest don't know how to perform CPR. That costs nearly 400,000 people their lives every year. But Nicole Griggs shows that CPR can just take you minutes to learn. At 100 compressions per minute. Nick Gill is a CPR trainer with the American Red Cross. Tonight, he shows us how to do CPR using just your hands without doing mouth to mouth. Gill says there are three things you need to remember to help save a life. First, check your scene. I want you to check the scene for safety. Uh, as long as the scene is safe, you check the victim for consciousness. Uh, if the victim is unresponsive, then we're going to call 911. And then that's the second step, calling 911. And then third, you're going to want to use only your hands and start pressing on the chest. So we find the spot right in the center there of the breastbone. We use the heel of our hand interlacing our fingers, keeping our fingers up off the chest, having our shoulders directly over top of the center of the chest there so that way we can use our body weight to then push down at least two inches on the victim's chest. This hands-on approach is for people like Jim Merrick, no longer certified. And at this point I'm not. I was at uh, a job required it uh, years ago, but um, I think in a pinch I might be able to help someone. The hands-on approach is meant to give everyone the knowledge. This is hands-only CPR, so our, our hope is to be able to reach out to about 5 million people with this citizen CPR, this hands-only CPR. In Dayton, I'm Nicole Gregg.